Welcome back everybody, let's play. Spider-Man the movie, the video game. Come on. This isn't working out too favorably. Good, your strength Put your rifle away, dude. I hoped it would be. The true cheater. Does not uh, so. Oh, hi. Let's make his potion. Tom and ugly. So, we found, uh, Craven last episode. For some reason. Those potions make him too strong okay, to you're forcing my hand, dude. So there's health in here, but going down here means other things. So basically, Craven has kind of a gimmick in that he, uh, he also likes to pop up in, in this maze. He has a uh, potion he likes to use that uh, restores a lot of health. Gas! Better find a way out, and fast! Also, this gas hurts like crazy. Uh, I can see the bugle headline now. Wannabe goblin found an air vent. Embarrassing. Oh, come on, there's a uh, combo you can find in here too. But there's, there's a combo you can find somewhere out there, not that you exactly have time. I was kind of wasting my time trying to find it. But like this says, Craven is nearly invincible. Uh, he does a lot more damage and he um, takes very uh, little damage. You'll see, you'll know that he uh, has drink, taken his potion when he. Uh, there we go. Come join red. Like that. And uh, how much of his potion he has remaining is. Screw you. How much of his potion he has remaining is his blue bar. Anyways, I guess there's not much benefit to me. Oh, no, I can just put him down there. I'm just gonna wait for that to run out real quick so I can, uh, Now's my chance to take play him like crazy. Ah, truly you are my and he is pretty agile, but, okay, so, now I'm just about to help, I need to pick up that help down here. Stakes don't really give a crap about you. Decisions, decisions. Craven Wally Spear down here. Ah, the glider you are my most worthy prey. Run on through here. Go for the vents. Yes. Better find a way out and fast. Uh, one of these paths through the vent. Haven't I been here before? Yeah, well, one will give you that. The other one will. Better hurry. That gas is coming into the vents. Let you run out and not die. Also, if you go back down there, you can uh, go back into the snake pit. You can actually uh, get more health too. That health responds. Whoa, he threw me! Oh crap. Oh, come on! I thought I killed him right there. I guess I'll have to pick up the haymaker again. Uh, if I actually punched him, I probably would have ended a bit well. More well. Huh. This isn't a tough fight. It's actually quite... It's something you just have to end quickly, I guess. He also shoot you from the very beginning and do a lot of damage when he does so. Come join me. I mean, if you feel like messing around with him, those potions make him too strong to take head on. Like, buttons aren't doing what they usually do. Yeah, if you feel like you can try to hurt him when he's uh, using his potion, you can still hurt him a little bit. The main thing to use is your uh, point blades, like usual. But that's not doing much good right now. Now's my chance to take Oh, not, it's not really my chance, because I need to get out. Anyways, it's the second highest path you want to take to get this, uh, combo, but this isn't the second highest path right now. Oh, well, I guess. Oh, yeah, I never noticed that spider pattern, pattern in the fire. Well, I guess I can't really go, through, go back through there, can I? The zoo never seemed this dangerous when I was a kid. No, I thought that I remember that uh, health responding right there. And that room locks forever. So yeah, maybe you can only go down go through here once. Which means you also only get one chance to get that uh golden spider. I knew I was gonna die there, but I kinda wanted to redo things anyways. Huh, so today is the episode, well, 
this level and the previous one are just the levels where I do fine first playthrough, and now I am a huge embarrassment to myself. It's nice. A true hunter does not need guns. Come join me in the Okay, so I just suddenly don't have health. True hunter does not need guns, sure, but you were sniping the crap out of me earlier. He's initially he'll actually use a uh, gun, a rifle, to attack you. Instead of uh Initially use a, use his rifle to, to attack instead of his uh, sword of some sort or another. Haven't I been here before? Better hurry! That gas is coming into but, the uh, vents. It all hurt a lot. I mean it when I say that. Oh come on, he drank the potion again? Come on! I don't have time for that. I just can't survive that. I guess that health only responds if you're not playing on superior difficulty. But now I'm the poison is intermittent throughout this entire place. My will seek you wherever you hide. I'd like to see right here. You can still do some damage when he's under the effect of the potion, but it's not enough. Loser. I can feel your blood boiling. Oh, pfft, okay. Yeah, like I said, it's just something you have to end really quickly. You're really miffed with this game tonight. It took me absolutely forever to finish the first level of last episode. I was always frustrated with that. Now he has the potion. How do I just do that? Do this. That didn't help me much. It's for you too. Decisions, decisions. But not down there. Don't go through that room. Because there's literally nothing I would ever want down there. Now's my chance to take Craven out. Ah, the hunt is glorious, is it not? Alright, I, now I need this. My yes. what doesn't hurt. Better find a way out. And, fast. and I need to get out. Uh, I can see the beautiful headline now. Wannabe goblin found in air. Better hurry! That gas is coming into the vents! Yeah, I know, I can feel it. And of course, he is in his powerful form. But not much left. He just throws an unlimited amount of blades, because why not? I don't know why anything that can throw blades in a video game has unlimited amount of supply of them. Ah, the hunt is glorious, is it not? Seems to be like some kind of unspoken rule. And I was screwed the instant he drank that potion again. See, the reason that you have to end this fight so quickly is because you're taking damage throughout the whole thing, and for the majority of the fight, he can't actually take almost any damage at all. I think the fact that he drinks the potion more than once is kind of overpowered. But, oh well. A true hunter does not need guns. Come join me in the dance of death. <laughs> okay, you just fly down there. Those potions make him too strong to take. I'm guessing Craven never won many good sportsmanship awards. He just locks you in here, decisions, follows you around decisions. like a crazy man. With a sword. Ah, the hunt is glorious, is it not? Screw off. Now's my chance to take Craven No, it's out. not. That was my chance to be end up dead, yes. if anything. Although I have plenty of chances to do that. Been here no, before? you haven't. Shut up. Hurry. That gas is coming into the vents. He's not gonna come up here before drink it. Uh, until he drinks his potion, is he? Yeah, that's exactly what he did. That jerk. Ah. Uh. Poison just hurts you so quickly. And it's not really worth trying to. And then he jumps down there. Okay, what a jerk. Ah. 
Seriously. It's not even worth trying to hit him when he's not doing that. Yeah, this is... Oh, whoa, his eyes actually get all fire when he drinks potion. That's cool. But man, I'm getting tired of this. I don't even remember what the next level is. Oh, the next level after this one's actually a nice easy one. Thank God. Because the next level doesn't... Next episode doesn't have fun things in store for me either. Besides, a true hunter does not need guns. Come join me in the dance of death. Hell. Hell. Those potions make him too strong to take head on. I'm guessing Craven never won many good sportsmanship awards. Decisions, decisions. I, it's a good idea if you can uh, handle it to actually do some damage to him down here. Well, if you can get him stuck on a wall, I guess that works too. I think is there's some health down here, so you can afford to lose some health right here, right now. No. Gas. Better find a way and get out. Fast. Haven't I been here before? Yes, but yes. Now you're about to die. So get the hell out. Better hurry. That gas is coming into the vents. Now he has the potion again. And now he's up here. Okay. So I should be able to take him out now once he has run out of potion effect. Ah, the hunt is glorious, is it not? Let's go. Bomb. Meet sword. What the hell wins? Okay. Oh yay. So yeah, I get a secret found for having picked up the gold spider, which is nice. But anyways, I got some style points. I actually got a decent amount of points here. Controller, stop dying. I know you have dying batteries, but the other batteries died more for reasons that I don't really understand whenever I unpause the game. So, anyways. Time for something nice and relaxing to finish off the episode before the wonders of next episode, too. On two. Now that we're done with Craven, for <laughs> who we encountered for reasons unknown, we just kind of woke up in the gas chamber and then fought him. But, uh, let's meet up with our old friend again. You can? I didn't. You don't need those at all. I managed to get through this level without any of those the first try last time. Okay, no more distractions. I need to track down that imposter and finish things. Congratulations, Osborne. Dealing with you just moved to the top of my to-do list. Looking for me, boy? Well, pretty cool. So, this is actually pretty cool when you're playing as the goblin. Um, using your own razor, razor bats isn't very practical, but it's just so satisfying. All you have to do in this level is take out a bunch of razor bats. But it's so satisfying to do yourself. Or to uh, have your own ra razor bats to take some of them out. Uh, his razor bats will take out a lot of yours. And uh, you can only summon so many razor bats, not only at once, but also without uh, running out of web. Which is sad. But, uh. An imposter can keep away from me too easily. I need to focus on the razor bats. Come on. Don't worry, bats. Can't attack him right now. That guy isn't messing around. I gotta lose uh, him. Just not any weapon will work on them. Of course, the. Uh, you have razor bats too, I see. Of course, the inferno bombs don't do you any good. But any other I weapon will work pretty pleased. well. Even the Vulcan guns, although that's kind of a kind of a luck thing. Well-aimed homing blades will work pretty well. 
bombs. We'll take out lots at once. To some degree, it can be a good idea to use your. Uh, you usually want to use your Vulcan guns when you have a ton of them after you. But, uh. Razor bats don't really do anything good for this fight. It's more of just kind of a for fun type thing. But I like doing it a lot, so. The thing about the homing blades is they usually only hit one Razor bat. And you actually have to be facing Razor bats to use it. Razor bats. I have to do something fast. I want you. You had your chance. Right now. Yeah. Not just yet. Haha, <laughs> accurate shot. I think we fought enough. Come on. Why don't I get this many razor bats? Can keep away from me too easy. Seriously. I need to focus on razor bats. Yeah, the explosion on the punk can take out a couple of them, but it's not gonna be anything impressive. There we go, that's nice. But, uh, Homing Blades can take out a couple of them, if you're lucky. Oh, crap, come on. But usually I'll just take out one. Crap. They don't do that much damage, it's just lots of scratch damage over time. And as you'd expect from Razor Bats. Leave me alone. But it adds up, if you can't actually attack back. It can be hard to hit them though. Like, if you need it, there are uh, health pickups on the buildings as the are the pausing you. Okay, I guess I need it at this point. Do I? Probably do. If you're just kind of like moving a circular motion, they won't hit you as much. They'll still hit you a lot. Okay, fine. Jerks. I would have liked it to actually re replicate my first play through the level and not use any of them. So I wasn't actually right there were any. But whatever. I think we've put up with enough of these. But. Screw you. I'm getting torn to pieces. Yes, I am. I have to get away. I think I saw a construction site around here. There's got to be somewhere there I can hide. It's all of our own razor bats. Now you can actually. You can run, but you can't If you want hide. to, you can actually keep taking these things on. No, I don't think that's true at all. I know there's a hiding spot somewhere around here. All right, you can keep finding some of it if you feel like it. And in fact, if you do. Come on, dude. You have enough web. Thank you. If you feel like it, you can actually take on more. I seriously need to get out Which here. will. Fine, Harry. Give you a point bonus afterwards. Westlake Evolution. Need to get That's what I'm doing. Shut up. And we haven't seen these in a while. Big blue and red spider. Didn't off the level. Yay. So, that was kind of short. What? Why did I not get any points for destroying more uh, razor bats? You jerk. I guess I need to destroy the entire last swarm. I'm not sure. I had figured that it was just you got some certain number of points for each extra one you destroyed. But, oh well. There's not much to do for combat style since I can only fight with my glider. But I'll see you guys next time, I suppose. In the next episode, let's play Spider-Man the movie, the video game, where we take on a level that I'm not fond of at all and kind of hate. I don't know how long the episode will be, in all honesty. We'll have to see. But uh, see you then, guys. Bye.